Hi, I'm Joanna Kirito, Assistant of Chinese Art at the Asian Art Museum, and I'll be talking about self-elected social distancing in Chinese literati culture. I'm grateful to curator Li He for sharing her research on these artworks. Taking retreats by social distancing was a main trend among educated Chinese men and a very popular theme in literati art and Chinese landscape painting. Related to elegant gatherings, the ideal of withdrawal from urban society allowed for close communion with nature, art, and learning. This Chinese painting by Wu Wei, titled Observing the Flying Crane, is a fine example of the subject of seclusion deep in the mountains and will be shown in the Chinese painting gallery. In the center of the composition, an old man sits by an open window inside a riverside pavilion, turning his head back to look at a crane taking flight in the lofty sky. His bared chest is visible from a loose rope with front panels wide open, conveying his free spirit and informal lifestyle. He is fanning with a feather fan, a subtle tribute to his connection with birds. Beside him are two young servants, one following the master's gaze in search of the flying bird, the other bringing him books. Outside on the winding path, a man who seems to have just gotten off a boat by the river bank carries a covered zither chin, a musical instrument as he walks towards the studio. The environment surrounding his cottage offers insight into the hermit's life and activities. Seen here is a large calligraphic screen forming the back wall, placing the man in a study. The main scene begins with riverbanks, leading us higher towards the hills and a country house behind the rocky hills. Then we get into the mountain peaks in the far distance. They all invite us to share in the excitement, amusement, and enjoyment of the depicted participants. The figures chose social distancing and were able to find meaningful value from learning, understanding, and engaging with nature. Historically, social distancing was actively chosen by way of social isolation. But now, thanks to social media, social distancing does not mean social isolation. Nevertheless, classical art, in a way, functions as today's social media, equally effective and inspiring. Thank you for watching this artifact from the Asian Art Museum.